afternoon. Uh, Ash Outdoors here. Actually outdoors, at home, just waiting for the weather to calm down a little bit before I go out. It's going to be a bit of a different one today. I had uh, had some plans, working at an awesome little little uh, bungalow that I've been refurbing for a builder friend of mine. Um, just outside the front door there was a lovely bit of woodland so I asked quite nicely the um, the owners of the estate if I could use it for a, a wild camp and they didn't let me so I'm going to do a bit of a, an urban stealth camp today just in Cambridge a couple of miles away just a spinny a little bit of uh, woodland so I'm going to go and check that out I want to try out a new sort of lightweight system that I've been using for um, that I want to be using for some hiking trips later on in the year. So obviously I'm using my winter gear at the moment, but I'll be using my summer stuff then. And uh, I'm going to be using my poncho. Fair time lucky. God, my hair looks fluffy today, doesn't it? And grey. Um, yeah, going to use my poncho as uh, a tarp and chuck a big ba bivvy bag under it. And it has been proper wet for the last week. We've had those two storms, one after the other. So I think we're just tail end of it now. It's meant to be terrible rain. It's, we just got caught in a downpour. But um, it doesn't seem as bad now as the rest of the country's had it. So we might be lucky. Anyway, I'll um, stop talking and get on my little way. to a bit. Seems more like I'm doing the uh, school run than at wild camp. But uh, anyhow, nearly there. That over that direction is uh, where I'm going to stay. And kids are laughing at me because they can see an old man using a selfie stick. Yes, that's where I'm going. Um, I'll bring you back. Okay, so I'm in. Um, all I can see at the moment is like empty wraps of tin foil and uh, beer cans. So it's all brambly as well, which isn't ideal, especially as I'm in the bivvy tonight. And uh, yeah, it just looks like a bit of a drug spot to be honest. But I'll go a bit deeper in. Ah, I got attacked by the brown shit. <coughs> Can't teach me. Let's look where I'm going and stop filming myself. Oh, nice. I'll leave no trace, guys. It's like someone's had a fun time on the old side of the And the heavens have opened again. Oh mate, I haven't even got the tarp set up yet. I had to get the I had to go and get the uh, camera off the tripod. Big battery. It. This could be another fact. <laughs> Holy shit. We gotta get the bag in. I'm literally right under my poncho at the moment. Probably rake it out. You know, it's only off because the camera is getting smacked. Okay, so as per usual, caught in the rain, but now sunshine in for us. I'm all set up. I don't know if you can see very well. Come around this way. So I've got the uh, 
Edie Poncho. Right, it's literally just walked under the the knot with the uh, stick in, prosthetic knot with the stick in, in the eyelet, and caught it on my back, and it's popped out. So my first fault with DD. I even need to put tabs on those, or um, better eyelets. So I'm going to have to find out another configuration now. Wicked. Okay, so change formation. I've only got the lean to going on. The little wizard's hat at the end. But at least I've got some headroom now with my uh, seat in my plastic plastic bag to add to the rubbish around here. So that's it, set up, bed and that to do in a minute, and then we'll enjoy the sunset. Okay, it's uh, starting to rain again. I don't know how, because it didn't seem to be a cloud in the sky at the moment, but I think it's just a party. Anyway, keep this one short. I know I'm waffling a bit in this video. So I'm gonna just chill out now. Um, would love to say thank you to everybody again. 500 subs now, which is incredible. 520 actually, as of today. So I'm over the moon with that. Big thanks to you all. Um, really appreciate it. I uh, never thought I'd get to 500, especially not this quick. It's only seen my a few months ago. I was on 200. Well, it was a couple of months ago. I was on 200. Um, so I'm going to do another giveaway, as I said, the 200 giveaway. Um, I'm not advertising it because um, I got so many comments on the last one, and I'm not even sure if the winner even watches my videos anymore. So, Christy. I hope you got your tarp all right, and if you watch my videos, leave us a comment, see how you're getting on with it. So anyway, this giveaway, I will be, I haven't actually ordered it yet, um, but I'm going to be giving one of these away, which is, so I picked it up, the Tokes Titanium Cup, which is, uh, this one's 500 millilitres, so I'll be doing the same as that. Uh, it comes in, ooh, no. That's it. 
as you've probably just seen me cooking my dinner, comes in one of these and little closable lid on it. Now, I've only put the elastic band around mine because I've managed to get in there one of those cheap 25 gram, um, it's just off Amazon I think, uh, 25 gram uh, gas cooker, BSR cooker head, I think it's Chinese mate, so Chinese writing underneath, so that with a little bottle and a titanium fork, that all fits in there but the lid just doesn't close quite properly but stays there but it all still fits in the bag, so yeah, I'll be giving uh, away one of those, not the not with gas and all that malarkey, just the cup. But they're awesome. That is so lightweight and it's enough to do one of your boil in the bag. Not boil in the bags, one of the dehydrated meals. So um, yeah, if you want to be in with a chance of winning one of these, just write I'm in in the comments. I'll do another random accumulator thing, whatever they're called. Uh, yeah, so that's it. So big thank you to everybody who's liked and subscribed already. If you haven't, hit that subscribe button and also a bell notification a little bell sign if you want to be notified every time i upload a video anyway i'm gonna have my wine my food will be ready in a couple of minutes so i'm gonna eat that and then just chill and hope i don't get blasted by any more rain anyway so the way i'm gonna do this but i've got a couple more shout outs um one of the shout out is uh, two of the shout outs are for channels I've been really enjoying lately. Um, so, the first one, Dave Outdoors. He is a funny guy. Uh, gets out loads, does a lot of hiking, nighttime navigations, and all that malarkey. So, uh, Dave Outdoors, I'll put his link in the description. Nice one, Dave. Uh, next one, the other channel I've been enjoying lately is. Um, 401 files ben from 401 files I believe it's carry outdoors other half um his channel's cool man he's got some like conspiracies and uh paranormal sort of uh, shenanigans going on over there so enjoying your stuff mate and my last shout out actually i thought it while i'm doing shout outs i've got number two so my two nephew and niece that watch me um ask when the next video is out amber and joshua All right guys um, hope you're enjoying this. It's a bit of a weird one, I must admit. Last but not least, um, shout out to Kim, my wife, uh, for putting up with me randomly going out and filming myself in the woods. She's great letting me out, just whenever I want really, so thank you very much. Anyway, oh and my boys, shout out Bob and Jack. I'm going to find a spot and uh, get my poncho set up. Okay, so what time is it? Half eight, 20 to nine. Just gonna get my head down. Um, I know it's early, but I'll be up at the crack of dawn anyway, so uh, nothing exciting happens. Um, yeah, so nothing else happens. I'll uh, see you in the morning. At night. Did it again, didn't I? Just a bit. This top was flapping around all night in the wind. Um, yes, yeah, so I've hardly slept really. Um, I was a bit drafty. Most of me was warm. There's a bit of my sleeping bag 
one of the sections with all the down in. All the down has got, uh, I don't know if it's clumped up in one area when it's got damp or something. But my butt was cold for a bit. So that was fun. I hope you can hear this alright because it's so windy. Yeah, anyway, I didn't sleep very well, so I think I'm going to get up now, have my coffee, and uh, take the kids to the cinema. So probably catch up from, on some sleep watching Sonic the Hedgehog. So, let's get a coffee on the go. So anyway, this is where I was, it's down here, all my stuff's gone, bags there, oh well, bags there, rubbish bag, ready to go. Puffy man. Right, I'm gonna, gonna call it a day now, because I think it's windy enough in here, so as soon as I get out and into the open, it's gonna be horrendous um filled up my bag with all those bloody special brew cans and as much rubbish as i could find it's an absolute shite hole to start with as soon as you get in it it's all right further down i suppose people just venture into this top part and get drunk um yeah so thank you very much for watching if you stuck by this far hope you enjoyed it a little bit of a different one tonight i actually quite enjoyed the camp in the end it was uh yeah, it's pretty, pretty decent. Yeah, it's good to get away, knowing I'm literally a mile from my house. So I probably wouldn't come up here in the summer though, by the looks of all the rubbish and stuff here. So uh, I could see it being a bit of a teenage drug then. Anyway, haven't already, like I said last night, like and subscribe. Look at all these bottles, man. Oh, should have bought another bag. I'm going to come back up here. It's bloody everywhere. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you on the next one. Bye bye.